No chill, no filter. What is popping? What's popping? And what is popping again, y'all? See who I got on the right of me and to the left of y'all, my young homie. Yeah. Tell them who he is, man. Larry Bull, man. You already know what it is. Bill side, we here. No chill, no filter with Big Ryan, man. Yes, sir. Oh. Yes, sir. Hey, man. Check this out, dog. Okay, the reason why I had this, man, I had to get the young homie on the show. I I, I caught his I caught his live and I had to share it. And you know what? You got an upcoming battle this Saturday on the 24th. Right. Make sure y'all in the house. I really, you know what? I'm not familiar with the place, but um, it's down on Houghton, 32-something. Uh, 3278 North Houghton is the address. Actually. What's the name of the place? It's called, uh, I guess it's called Thy, uh, Thy Castle. Thy Castle, that you is. Know, 3278 North Houghton Avenue. Yep. There it's you go. Be- it's going to be lit, man. We got a lot of great battles. A lot of stuff I even want to see that's on the card, not involving myself. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Speaking of which, let's speak of yourself, man. <laughs> you battling the Green Ranger, man. You know, yeah. that's a that's a pretty big deal for you, fam. I know. I know. Uh, it, this is the first battle that was handpicked by me. Okay. You know, okay. I picked this battle. Like, I saw a dude live at Spit That Heat. Mm-hmm. First time ever seeing him. First time ever even hearing his name. All that. And to watch that and to see that, I was like, oh. Yeah. I was like, because he was on, that was his first time here. Mm -hmm. You know, because he's been back since, because he battled G-Face right after that. Right. But he's like, and that was his first time here. And the way he just naturally came in and did what he had to do. It didn't matter if you knew of him or not. Because, you know, some people, you come to see a certain battler, you more amped when they say something because you're waiting on it. Right, right, right. I didn't know him or Pesos from Adam or Eve. Right, right. It was just. All right, bro. What what's on the card? Okay. Yeah. That Only was... niggas I was excited for was Hoodlum Gang is because I knew them. Right. You know what I'm saying? Me and Jay was already in the midst of working on the tag team when I was going to that. So I most definitely wanted to come see what he had on deck. Right. You know right. what I'm saying? And Hoodlum, once again, I always say was one of the first people who got me even interested in saying I'm gonna do this shit. Right. This shit look fun. You know what I'm saying? So, well, you you making it you making it look like it's a whole lot of fun because you're definitely taking care of your business, but um. You know what? This year is going to be definitely a show improved battle because we talking like you done came from people like um, your very first battle, which did drop, was an out of town battle. Mm-hmm. Um, I, what was that? What was his name? Works. Works. That is. That was a pretty decent battle, man. But it was still kind of like not your was, level, although right, you was. was just coming in it and was a you know spur the moment phone yeah, call we, yeah. we all know how the story go on that right uh, right i was a 30 minute notice nigga for that one right he came in with too much bars right and then you came you went your next battle was at the the, the next say mercy event which was the classic two on two between um Hoodlum Hoodlum gang, gang, and gang and body gang, gang of that course was, ooh, and that then was that's so when you battled um bobo. bobo that he just he wasn't he, he wasn't didn't come with enough books. yeah he wasn't serious yeah he I, I i ain't gonna say he wasn't serious but he just didn't have enough fun he thought it was sweet enough where he whatever he was saying he was gonna be able to just walk through me bro because yeah because he even like i watched his uh his new battles and mm-hmm. when he battled face i wish he would have came at me like that <laughs> right okay now, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, well, you know what? It was that's the what hardest he Bobo I had seen. Like, yeah, that, bro, all of this shit before that, I was like, that's why I came at him the way I did when I was like, you can't rap, you see, because you you walking through shit like it's too easy. Right, right. And then you tell Face you didn't take me seriously, and I was like, yeah, you're right, you didn't. You didn't even rap the Bottom whole time. line is, a dub is a dub, whether you came and went to sleep or didn't come at all. That wasn't my fault. I came, what I came to fight. Exactly, that wasn't my fault. Exactly. I'm so, not responsible for him. And then they put you up against this one dude, man, that... that... I'm going to just let you know I shit. That was, that was face dude, fought, man, dog. That, face ducked. That, that was why. one dude. You know what? He should have said, no, nah, I'm not, you know, ready for this type of stuff right now. So I'm going to let y'all. Saint did set um, him up, though. Dude, I ain't, set I ain't him up going. to get murdered. When he said, I feel like this is a setup, he won line because yeah, he had came man. in and actually spoke to us before I knew that face ducked. He came earlier in the event and uh, I was standing by the concession stand with Sid. And he walks up and he's like, uh, yeah, this is my first time coming to really see it in action. Yeah. Uh, I go. To, I work with Saints, so you know I know that he's been doing it, whatever, whatever. But I rap, you know. I do the. I be on beats and shit, and I freestyle and I do ciphers and whatever. Right. And then he was asking me, "Did I battle today?" I was like, "Yeah." 
And they was like, how many battles do we got? And then uh, this is before the two on two happened. So technically I was only still just two and oh. Yeah, right. And that's what Sid just said. He's like, two and oh. Dude. So when, he, when they said that and then Saint them was like, oh, bro, Ducks, we need a stand in. Do you want to, you know, try out today? They didn't tell him that. Yeah, man, that he was going up against the likes of you. He didn't know. You know I mean, but saying? you know, in any event, you know, that's just like whether whether. And that whether was another he... one that everybody like, oh, it don't it don't count. All niggas was no. doing was watching my performance and seeing if my bars was either gonna fall off or get better from what they heard from the very first time. Right. Well, in any event, man, you definitely murdered him. It was overkill. But uh -huh. honestly, this one right here, this one right here, this one, this, this, this is one here, what nigga, I this, want. this one right here. And see, here the thing is, man, you it's like y'all kind of like evenly matched because both of y'all are very animated when you when you're performing. And I, I call it performances. That's that's really what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a performance. Bars are supposed to be there, period. Yeah, this is gonna come down to what we say though. That's why yeah. I know like even like he's a bar seller. Yeah. So just a quick prediction, man, and I already know what you're gonna say. Now is this a three or one? Three. Three rounds. Three, three rounds. Minutes, man. Yeah. Three rounds, three minutes. Okay. Um and Unfortunately, I won't be um, shooting this battle. You coming, um, though, right? Yeah, yeah, I'll be there. You know, I'll be covering okay. the battle. I'll probably do a couple of interviews, you know, do the face depending, or depending on, man. yeah, most, most definitely, man. You know, depending on how people feel. It's not, you know, a no chill, no filter TV affiliated event. So, I mean, I'm not, you know, tripping on that or nothing like that. But, you know, I'm just making sure that, you know, everybody is comfortable with me being in the building and what I'm doing, what I'm doing. Mm -hmm. But, in any event, <clears throat> uh, so between you and Riso, man, get, give me a quick prediction man what you thinking i mean and, and, and keep it all the way 100 now because this dude is not no pushover oh i know, I know okay I know. so so talk to me um honestly i prepare for everybody like they gonna come and 30 me so in response i'm trying to 30 him i wouldn't be surprised if this is 2-1 me but I'm personally trying to go 30 this dude, man. Like, there ain't no ifs, ands, or buts about it. There mm. is no lacking, no slipping, no slacking on this side. On the Ville side, we will not be caught slipping. So you said you go 30 the Green Ranger? <clears throat> man, look, I am the biggest fan of Power Rangers. <laughs> Listen to me. I am the biggest fan of Power Rangers. There is not anything about a Power Ranger that you can't tell me. And one thing about the Green Ranger is, I know that nigga well enough that he can be beat. Right, right. That's the whole thing about it. Every Like, I'm not coming into this expecting to be the favorite at all. I expect everybody to be anticipating that nigga. Well, I mean, you He's, know what? I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that, but... You definitely have to come. I got a point to prove still. Yeah, definitely. These, like, these outside of the two on two, and ain't nobody even seen that and seen what I did in that. Speaking of that two on two, I gotta let y'all check something out, right? I can't. I ain't got. I ain't got nothing to take a hit of. But y'all check this out. I'm holler at him right fast. Oh, not enough. We both pull up in a whip like two the trunk. I have to strap, bit this nigga back track like juice enough. I don't see enough in your pride, in your stride, and you the crutch. I'll fuck him up. Man, I'll fuck him up. Fuck, fuck it. Two wrenches swinging together, double dust. Oh, 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 Yeah, y'all see that, right? Double Dutch, <laughs> I mean, you know what? Shout out Jay Lopez and Hugo Gang. Man, man, the two on two was, was nasty. But um, like I said in the recap afterwards, man, ain't no way in the world it's supposed to be one, then two, then another one, then two, then two, then two. Because you know what? Honestly, Mr. NBA, um, you, you impressed me, man, but you didn't have enough for both me. of them, for real. You didn't have enough of both of them guys, enough. man. Yeah, you didn't have enough of both of them guys. But I told him that but, during the battle. But we'll, we'll talk about that yeah, later. I yeah, told him yeah. that. So we ain't even gonna worry about all that. Yeah, so look, y'all just saw just a quick, you know, um, I want to say, yeah, that's what it is. A quick clip of that. And I'm gonna have to make a quick clip of that anyway. So, in any event, man, um, my man versus Riso Wells, he said he gonna 30 him. It is what it is on Green that. Green candle is burning. Look at here, man. 
Illa versus Zilla. I got to see Woo! that myself. them niggas right there. I got to see I'll, that myself. Look here, I have to I have to be in the building. I yeah, have to be in the building. I gotta, when I, I found out that, that that got through on the card. Yeah. After, uh, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't remember the battle The battle card dropped. And it was uh, originally just like me, Riso, and then a couple other dudes. Right. And then, um, bang, they added that one on. I was like, Illa versus Zilla? Yeah, man. Because I remember seeing the battle where Zilla came at him. Yeah, man. And, and you front, know what? In front of John John. Yeah. Well, I didn't see that. But here, here's here's the, here's the thing right here, man. Um, Illa will be in the uh, in the house, and you know he actually did a live with your uh, uh, your quick interview at that that one event with um, with Ira versus Jay Lopez. He saw that, and he he kind of did a. I mean, so so what do you think? You think it's gonna be a little bit of tension in the house behind that? Uh, huh? We finna battle. When? Uh, it just got locked in. Oh, uh, uh, okay. So it's set up. Yep. Okay, well you know what? We gonna we gonna we gonna we gonna leave that to the end of the show because we wanna get through this. But I just wanna let it let it be known that Illa will be in the house. Yeah. And if anytime that y'all get in each other face, I'm gonna go click. You already know that. Mm -hmm. So Uncle Sam versus Uncle Sam versus T Lou. I don't know who set this up. Um, T Lou better win that shit, bro. Yeah, Uncle if... Sam don't be rapping. I proved that. <laughs> Put another clip right, like right here. Then when I go like this, she puts some swoop in it or something. Just <laughs> but I'm on bullshit. But so is this. Cause y'all think this bull is shit just cause he's much newer? Then y'all right, kinda. It's just that this bull is shit just cause he's much newer. But I'm on bullshit. One hard ass bar towards Uncle Sam. Cause the yeah. nigga not rapping, bro. Yeah. Well, Uncle Sam got a few bars. He has his moments. You know, but, T, I can't but I've say seen T. Lou actually pick apart somebody before, yeah, man. Yeah, T. Lou Cole can't, can't you know take what nothing I'm from he's it. Got one of, he's one of those niggas who, who, can, who can make niggas laugh at you and still be aggressive. Yeah, yeah. He's definitely. the kind of nigga who can call you like a dirty, ugly, stupid, and then the way it come out of his mouth, we just get to laughing. Right, right. Sam um, ain't got nothing for T. Lou, dog. Right. I'm um, picking that one 30. Right. Okay. Thirty in favor, T. Lou. T. Lou versus Uncle Sam. Watch him land. Nigga. I got. I got T. Lou also. Um, Scotty Lyrical versus Mind Scribe. I don't know who Mind Scribe is. Sounds but like a wash to me, Scotty. Scotty, stay humble, man. Don't come in this battle like you, the best man that ever walked the earth, hey, man. Don't man, rap, you, cause for real, for too. real. You better come through, cause look here. I told you this, mm. and I'm gonna say it again, bro. If you come out here. And we see something less than what we already saw. Just read that just dropped. If we see anything less than that, bro, I'm ribbing you. Yeah, I'm man. On, I'm on your ass from the jump. I'm going to tell you everything. I'm not going to lie to you about nothing. I'm coming straight to you, bro. And I'm letting you have it. Because I speak, I, I, I feel and speak highly of you, bro. Being a nigga that I was in the same crew with you at one point, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And it's always going to be love. And I still look at you as bro. So when you come out and rap, nigga, whoever this nigga is, we don't know him, bro. 30 him. Bottom line is, man, all that old Alum antics, man, running up in people's face and pushing them. Stop doing that rap, fam. Because really, that's unimpressive to me. All that old. Because honestly, you're not talking hard enough to get in somebody's face like that, man. Stand back, man. G give a person three feet. Don't keep getting all in people's face and pushing on me that's not you that I, that ain't never been you if you ask me your, your voice ain't carrying like that fam so if you're gonna battle this man battle this man at a, at a nice little pace man and, and holler at him all that old you know getting all in his face man that's not winning battles right there your bars is so just remember that fam you know what i'm saying uh, this just this is just me talking though i don't know maybe everybody yeah, that else like that he, i ain't never seen him do that before until yeah, that battle uh, so so it was different and now yeah you're right he might but was just overexcited because and he don't had, and don't Show. He had, that's the main thing. But he hadn't been in the ring in a while, so I give him that. Like he was just that excited to go bounce on a nigga because the right. last nigga ducked him, and then before right. that he didn't have a good outing. So it's like, right? He, like he said, yeah, he ain't been in the ring in over six months. He was right. Well, in any event, moving right along, I like your energy. Keep the energy, man. Oh, just yeah. lose the lose the aggression all in people's face. So, um, with that being said, man, Mr. NBA versus Maserati Buck. I've never seen Buck. But NBA uh, I'm has not think. impressed me yet, so I'm going with the, the Buck dude, just um, because of 
what I've seen from NBA and I haven't seen from Buck. I'm going with the underdog and the unknown. Yeah, well, with me, uh, Maserati Buck, I, I feel he do got bars. He may get off. I still haven't had a chance to really see him do anything. And Mr. NBA has been in the ring and he has been cooking. So that could go either way. Depends on what Maserati Buck win, uh, 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 what Maserati Buck shows up, and what NBA, what Mr. NBA shows up. Dude, don't look if you gotta if you gotta shoot darts or something, fam. Why don't you send a memo to the league owner today, man? Cause I don't want to get to that battle, man. And Maserati Buck standing there waiting on you, fam. And you somewhere, you know, bowling uh, or shooting darts or something. Yeah. And um, speaking of which, ain't that? Hold on, you know what? Um, once again, I'm gonna let y'all check that out, and I'm gonna holler at him right fast. <laughs> NBA. Mm -hmm. Nigga, you like basketball, right? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, you finna love this. Hey, wait, hold on. <laughs> he be playing darts, bro. Well, then let's get straight to the <laughs> point. You know, Jay Lopez said it too, so I mean, obviously, there's something going on. Dolce Goldstein versus Alias. Dolce, I'm kind of disappointed in you, fam, because you ducked the last battle, man. You no, had fresh here. I'm playing, I'm playing. <laughs> really? Oh, I was going to say, oh, but... it was on, it was on some, uh, on when we was trying to book for the, uh, the last AOW event that I was at. Um, then we was in the group chat, and they threw his name out. It's, uh, the original person they wanted to see me battle, and he just didn't respond. He didn't even say nothing. He didn't even say it. Right. And okay. that's how we ended up with Vex, and then G-Face, and then the Sacrificial Lamb. Right, right, okay, yeah, yeah, that's exactly what it was. I don't do rematches! <laughs> right, so Dolce, check this out, man, show up, fam, that, that's all I got to say, I'm not gonna say nothing else about that battle, I don't know who Alias is, I know you do cook, fam, so show up, fam, that's all I got to say, show up. Um, Ira versus STP, I got Ira because Ira got way more bars, yeah. um, STP gonna have to really do something, man. You gotta actually I mean, rap for me one time, man, like, yeah. don't depend on us to gas you, I hated that about his yeah. whole performance against yeah. Scotty, like, it could've been a classic battle because y'all evenly matched, bro, or at least y'all was that night. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? But you fucked up your own rounds and 30 yourself, bro, on top of what Scotty dumped on your life real quick, bro. <laughs> like, he was dumping you down, but you made your bullets less less shootable by fucking dropping bullets worrying about us going, ooh, bro. Right. Strap, dog. Yeah. That that would be nice if, if you could just, you know, don't rap, rap for the camera and the, the thousands or hundreds of thousands or whatever that's going to be actually watching the battle. The don't, don't rap for the crowd that's there for the oohs and ahs, fam. And that's coming from a fan aspect because I was watching that battle. Right. I wasn't being biased at all. I wanted to hear what both of y'all had to say because I had no idea what Scotty was going to say. And right. I had no idea who you even was, bro. Right. And then to see y'all, you know what I'm saying, Scotty was doing this thing. I was like, don't worry about us. Both of y'all all... Could have had the same pro could have had the same problem. Scotty didn't go for that. He started rapping, bro. He didn't worry about us. Right. That was what you needed to do. Right. I even said rap to both of y'all. Like, bro, rap. Just go. Let me right. hear the rap. Mm -hmm. Okay, moving right along, man. Um, we got uh Doughboy versus D Nice. I like D Nice. Don't know who Doughboy is. D Nice um, is who battled Hoodlum recently, right? At the same event. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I think D Nice got some bars. He probably got something for the dope boy kid. Especially if this is a, a set up, prepare battle. Like that was on the spot. He, they said he freestyled too against Hoodlum. He just scrapped his whole book right. and went off the dome with him. So right, and that, and that was nasty. That, yeah, that first, yeah. that first like minute and a half was nasty in that first round. Yeah, yeah. He got off. He got off. Moving right along. Millie Boy Fears versus Millie Spades. Oh, if I'm he's not on mistaken, the card. Oh! Millie Spades is that dude. The that sacrificial one, lamb. That one dude. Get paper. You ain't know that I'm raw. And you will never in your life, my nigga, ever become a boss. I'm the type put my hands around your neck. And I turn your Adam Zeppelin into applesauce. I don't do rematches. Eee, you know what? I think I need to get a face off. Not a face off, just a, a post battle with you dudes, because I need to know exactly what was in on dude's mind. Um, he that didn't was, know. That, that was, was just really a what bit was on much, his mind. Man. He didn't know. Yeah, that that was a bit much right there. That that was a battle that was just. And he I understand, man. You know what? Whatever the case, whatever was going on. That battle right there was just super stupid, ridiculous. Yo, you gotta be, you gotta, you gotta be mindful that you know your your first impression is your best, man. And so he had some bars too, man. But people was not. He had what now? But he had a couple bars. He, he did. Okay. Like 
But you know how like, like once again, it was his first time, and he's being uh, thrown in the fire out gate, and then this is after I've rapped. Now, if he'd have yeah. went first, he probably would have actually remembered his whole round and not have went off into the freestyle thing that he did. Yeah. Because he started off written. I could hear it. He was ready and he had some shit because Saint was like, do what we practiced. I heard him say that before the battle. You know what? He should battle He should battle um, Subway. <laughs> Subway versus That's how you get your, Millie, that's how you get your legs back battling that guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Millie Space, and, and you know what? Mess around. We talking about Millie Space. He mess around, come and kick somebody's jaws up in their ass. You never know. Yeah, I mean, but, but I get, I give you one thing though, because he battled me out gate like that, and like I said, he really does feel like he was set up to a degree because mm -hmm. he didn't know. Like nobody told him like, oh, that nigga be snapping, or he actually really got some raps under his belt, even though his battle count is low. Yeah. Well, in any event. Here's the deal. Y'all just heard our uh, prediction on the upcoming Kill to Survive. Is that what it yep. is? Card. Kill to Survive. Card. Okay, yeah, UBL. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's AOW? I thought that was UBL. Mm -mm. Oh, okay, I thought that was that G card. Gray. Okay, but either Kill way it goes, it, it's... It's a it's a nice card, you know what I'm saying? It's you know it's, it's a few on there that's that's gonna be a couple of yawners, but my favorite I mean, battle it better be it's gonna be okay. My favorite battle better be Illa, Illa versus, versus Zilla. Zilla. That's gonna crack. That's gonna super crack. And I got okay. both of them niggas on my list. Man, them dudes is cold. Now I got a they question got for you. Yeah, most definitely. I got a question for you, fam. Just before before I wrap this up, man. Okay. Um, THC click. You are no longer. No. So you are freelancing now. Uh, no, I'm Vilside. I create. Oh yeah, you've been Vilside. You know, um, that that is basically where it's at now. Uh, and it ain't even no no hard feelings or nothing like that. It's just, just I, wanted, that I just wanted to be with be with me, man. That's it. Like right. it ain't even like Bridge Steel, bro. Like most of my battles is on Say Mercy. The, the Illa battle, mm -hmm. that's gonna be on Say Mercy. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Britt okay. was the person who made that battle happen. And this dude, he just did this on my last one. That once again, he 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 is in my vlog. <laughs> that's crazy. I mean, but but he said 8:30 a.m. and here it is 12:06 p.m. I'm not understanding this. So he so once again, so once again, so once again, time, so once man. again, he's Damn. on my. So once again, he's cutting into my vlog. Look, this is no filter right here. No chill, no, no filter, filter TV. Sky, man. Okay, in any event, y'all see him? Can y'all see him? Any, anyways, man. Forehead ass nigga, man. Look, we, <laughs> I got my man, I got my man, uh, Larry Boy here, man, doing his thing. You know what I'm talking about? What's going on, Lou? <laughs> okay, but check this out, man. We gonna sign off. My man just said what he had to say. Tell him who he is again, man. Oh, and we gonna get up out of here. You know who it is, man. Larry Bull, Bill Side, man. Kill to survive. Larry Bull versus Reso, February twenty fourth. That's this Saturday. Shit's going down, man. I'm putting bullet holes in that motherfucking green shield, nigga. We about to get the Green Ranger to fuck out the command center, man. Zordon said so. Let's Ooh. go, man. Be in the house, man. This your big homie MC Ryan Ski. The OG. There's no chill, no feel. The TV, and you know how we feel about feelings around here. Keep them to yourself. Oh. Yeah.